Prince Harry has had a scary accident in front of his celebrity friends as he returned to the polo field in California and it was captured by photographers. Very lucky he was unscathed in the incident at the Santa Barbara Polo and Racquet Club. Dramatic pictures show the Duke of Sussex being flung to the ground as other polo players rush over to check on him. But he got back on his feet to continue the game at the Santa Barbara Polo and Racquet Club. Prince Harry donned a green top, white trousers and black riding boots and knee pads as he basked in the typical LA heat, before being seen mounting his brown horse and putting on his helmet and protective goggles for another round of play. The Duke of Sussex competed in a match, as he plays for the Santa Barbara Polo and Racquet Club's Los Padres Polo team on Sunday. After a flying visit to UK for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee where he reportedly only had a quite formal 15 minutes with his grandmother. At one point, while making a sharp turn, Harry, and his horse, fell to the ground. And the Duke of Sussex took a tumble during the game. The prince could be seen kneeling on the ground behind the equine, his white pants covered in dirt, while the horse laid on its side with its hooves curled inward. Witnesses said the Duke went through three polo ponies in just one hour in what is a very grilling sport for the animals. However, the 37-year-old quickly got back on his feet after he was flung to the ground and other polo players came to check on him. Fortunately for both, the two got back on their feet, and the prince was captured walking alongside the equine, his hand on the horse's back. However, Los Padres eventually lost the game. But, Prince Harry didn't appear too downcast by the result, because he was seen hanging out with friends on the sidelines including American Idol runner-up Catherine McPhee, 38, her composer husband David Foster, 72, and their young son Rennie. One also saw the smiling but sweaty Harry with his arm around teammate Nacho Figueres wife Delfina and fist bumping others who came to support him, as friends said the Duke is living his dream in the US playing professional levels of polo while living in a Montecito mansion with his wife and two children. The royal, who is sixth in line to the throne, is listed as H Wales in the four-player lineup with his friend Nacho. He joined polo team Los Padres this year. His father, Prince Charles was also well known for falling off his horse in polo, breaking his arm on occasion and another spell in New Zealand where he tumbled from his ride three times in six weeks. The Prince of Wales also played competitive polo into his 40s, but finally retired in 2005 age 57, having mostly played in charity matches since 1992. In 2000 he was taken to hospital in Sirencester and forced to stay the night after a fall during a charity match in the Cotswolds when his sons, then 19 and 16, were on his team. The Duke's latest polo match occurred just days after he, Meghan, and their kids returned home from celebrating Queen Elizabeth II's Platinum Jubilee in the UK, during which the monarch met her great-granddaughter Lily, her namesake, for the first time. While Harry has always had a close relationship with his 96-year-old grandmother, there is still a lot of tension between the red-headed royal and his older brother, Prince William. It's reported Prince William and Kate didn't attend a first birthday party for Harry and Meghan's daughter, Lilibet. Queen Elizabeth got some FaceTime with her great-granddaughter for the first time, but didn't allow photos of the meeting. It was claimed he spent just 15 minutes meeting the Queen when the Sussexes flew in from California to attend her Platinum Jubilee celebrations, where they were barely seen in public before jetting home again. Archie and Lilibet weren't seen at all. Thank you for watching our latest video about the royal family. We always try to regularly update the latest news videos about the British royal family to meet your requirements. Our channel always has an objective, multi-dimensional view of the news. My main goal is just to entertain people. Hope you enjoy this news. If you have any questions or requests about content to watch, please leave a comment below this video of us.